And the Sandoval County election fiasco gets uglier today when a state police officer and election worker face off. Good afternoon, I'm Kim Baez. Another twist in the ongoing battle over ballots in Sandoval County where thousands of people had to wait in line up to five hours on election day. Yesterday, a judge ordered those ballots to be impounded. But today, lawyers for the county tried to stop that. News 13's Nancy Laughlin is live at the Sandoval, Sandoval County Administration Building with what's going on. Well, Kim, state police are keeping a close eye on those ballots. They're supposed to be canvassed here in a couple of hours. Here's what happened this morning. Take me to the ballots. Take me to the ballots right now. Sir, are you kidding me? Now, some unhappy election officials in Sandoval County, a state police showed up this morning. This after three people, including two Republican candidates who narrowly lost their races, filed a petition to impound voting ballots. They say they wanted to make sure there was no wrong during, during the voting and counting process. A judge agreed. But at noon today, lawyers for the county tried to stop that, saying that would get in the way of the canvassing process. Today, both sides met with the judge who came up with the compromise. The ballots would be impounded with a police officer and two people from each party keeping an eye on them until they're canvassed tonight. Both Republicans and Democrats have questions about how this is, has come out. So this isn't a partisan issue. This is about a transparency and fairness issue, making sure that every legitimate vote is counted and counted correctly. Okay, now after the ballots are canvassed, we're told that they're going to be locked up at the district attorney's office here in Sandoval County, and then a judge will have to decide what to do next and what that is. That is. Okay, thanks, Nancy. Now, it cost more than $2,100 to complete that impound process. The petitioners say the Republican Party is footing that bill. By state law, canvassing of the votes has to be completed today.